Well, when you think of California wine, many people think of Napa Valley. But there's another area in the Southland that's also known for its vineyards. And the best way to see it is from the air. Wes Parker shows us the good life in Temecula Valley. Hello everyone, it's Wes Parker for California Life. You see the balloons behind me, that's because we're at the Temecula Wine and Balloon Festival. Temecula, in case you don't know, is a little town inland from Oceanside, used to be a, a stagecoach stop. And it's north of San Diego, about an hour. So we came here because every year for a weekend, they have this little festival going to attract people to the city of Temecula. And today, I am going up in one of these balloons. Before the sun has even risen over Lake Skinner and Temecula, pilots and volunteers are on the scene, getting balloons ready for the early morning rides. Pilots like Kevin Knapp have been flying for years and look forward to sharing their passion with first-time flyers. And Kevin, what is the attraction for you? Well, it's magic. The day after I moved to St. Louis in 1989, I was out running. I met a balloon pilot and he said, here, hold this. <laughs> I've been doing it ever since. When you see the sky full of a, a kaleidoscope of colors, yeah. and as the pilot, when I look out at the crowd watching us, and I see their eyes get as big as saucers, I can hear them silently scream, wow, as we launch into the sky. And Temecula is a great place to be. The festival showcases some of the best wines from around the region. And it also highlights a city that has seen its population boom in the last 20 years. I have a resident, actually, of the Temecula area, Greg, who's a professor at Mount San Jacinto College. And I want to ask you, Greg, uh, not about your teaching, but just about living here, what is the attraction of the Temecula area, especially at this time of year? Sure. You know, Wes, I've been out here for 20 years with my family, and it's a great place to live because a number of reasons. Uh, the weather is very nice. It gets a little hot in the summertime, but it's an area that has the wine country out here. It has a nice infrastructure. It has enough shops. When I first moved here 20 years ago, Wes, there were very few things to do. The community was about 10,000 people in 1989. It's now about 220,000 people. Before the balloons can go up into the early morning skies, a few hours of setup go into making each one airborne. We are actually inside a hot air balloon, right in the middle of it. That is the top, and I'm excited. <laughs> Temecula has seen its share of growth, but it stays true to its roots with the Balloon and Wine Festival. Taking you up, up and away, I'm Wes Parker for California Life.